It's time now for Focus 50 Plus and Dr. George Schofield joining us. Good, Good morning. morning. <laughs> what are we talking about today? I had an experience this last week that I'd like to talk about. I think it's important for all of us. I attended a meeting where there was a fellow making a presentation mm -hmm. and he really wanted us to, he wanted to convince us that he was right and some other people were wrong. But what happened was he kept saying there are two sides to every story. There are two sides to every story, meaning we needed to believe his. Right. <laughs> the problem was if there are only two sides, we were either going to agree with him or we weren't going to agree with him. Those right. are the only options he gave yeah. us when he kept saying there are two sides to every story. And I was very struck by what happens if there are three sides to a story right. or right. four. Exactly. My mother always used to say there's three sides because there's your side, my side, and then the truth. <laughs> <laughs> and, the tr so, so the, and your mother was a wise, is a wise woman. <laughs> uh -huh. So what do we do? Like, what are some examples of getting locked on two sides? So one example would be supposing you have older parents and you come to the point where they're asking you to be responsible for their, for their estate if something mm. happens to them but they don't want to give you any information mm, okay. or have you sign on the checking account. Okay. You don't even know where the checking account is. So if there are only two sides to this story, either you give me the information or you don't. Exactly. You're locked in there. What would happen if there's a third side to the story and the third side could be, let's do this incrementally. Let's just talk about the checking account to start. Okay. I, w I think I need to be able to sign on the checking account and know where it is because if I don't, I can't do what you're asking me to do. Exactly. So we've suddenly moved from yes or no locked in to a third side of the story, which is taking it slowly when, you, when your kids were little. You remember trying to get them to eat vegetables if they didn't want to eat vegetables? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I do, too. I remember, too. So if you're on the two sides of the story, you're going to eat it or you're not, as opposed to, OK, let's, let's not keep fighting over this. We're locked into only two sides. What, what would you be willing to eat? What, what can we negotiate here is a third, is a third side. And it takes practice. It's really easy to just do yes, no, right, wrong, right. two sides to, the, to right. the story. But I was so struck by this fellow because he, he must have said it five or, five or six times. Uh -huh. But every time he did it, I felt as though right. he gave me it's no wrong. opportunity yeah. to come to some sort of middle ground which would be closer to him but not quite where I was. So we're running out of time. So are there steps to move it into that direction? Yes. To three? Okay. Yes. So if you're in that position, the very first step is stop and say to yourself, there are more than two sides to this. There's a third one. Okay. Second step, think about what a smart possibility would be. What's another angle that you could bring into it? Uh -huh. And then third, stop the conversation and say, if we're locked into this, there are only two sides to a story. It seems to me like we're going to, this is like a, like a wrestling match, right. a struggle. Uh -huh. Let's try introducing a third one. So one, stop and realize you're in, in this two situation. Uh -huh. Two, figure out what a smart one would be. And three, invite the other person into the conversation. It may sound like I'm just being very esoteric, okay. but with given all the things that are going on in the world at the moment where uh -huh. we're polarized, polls are not the only way to live or, or talk. All right, great information. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. See you next week. We're back after this.